hi guys welcome back to tutorial race and in this video you are going to learn uh, Django CRUD operations so inside that tutorial you are going to learn how to display the data from database so we have created here a view function and then students so it is more of like select start from students table it is like this okay so now we need to create a file called view.html so let's create inside template it'll be okay view.html now inside this we need to write the code here we need to write so it is not required for the time being right so this is our students list right and then head close here and then HTML close here then body start here and then body close here so inside this we will write the code so here we have written a table class table striped mm -hmm. then border small okay so this is the class now this is the heading and then first name last name email and then actions now after this we will create loop so for student in students so why this students this students is actually this one okay so for students in student then student dot SID we don't have this one so there is no point in displaying this and then no mobile also so let, let's remove this simply we have student or first name last name and email right and then add it so here will be added then student dot id student dot id in delay section and then now let's go to here urls and I need to write more the url here and then let's pass this code for view file now so this is the URL okay which we will access and this is our file name views.py and this is the function name so which function which we just created here inside view here this is the function name and this is the file name that is why we are writing here file name and then function name and this one is URL through which we will access the file. So now let's try to open the view. Oh, so it seems that something is wrong. Let's pack it in the block. So inside of view, okay, it'll be like this. module student start views has no attribute to view student start views has no attribute to view Tip student to the view No, it's fine. So there was condensing problem. Now it should work fine. Okay, so you can see now it is working. So first name, last name, email, and accent here, and then you can see here edit and delete so in the view section we can also write here hrf class so let's remove this btn btn success and in this one cl 
class btn btn danger so that it will look red okay so so that's it in this view section and in the next section i will display you i'll show you that how the delete will work so in the next video i will show you the delete functionality so stay connected and don't forget to subscribe and also press bell button thanks for watching